Hey guys, welcome back, and that one quest, um, it feels like that ingredient search, because it is a little search, I've gone over everywhere, so it leads me to believe I need to literally go over everywhere, Is anywhere in this region where I might be a fishing spot. Right, it does involve going everywhere, basically. Now, I'm not going to bother. Well, I'm not going to bother going to Mistwold yet because I have a feeling either I'm going to be sent to Mistwold for a quest or it's not going to be important. If I'm sent there as a quest, I can go there when I do the quest. If I'm not sent there for a quest, I can go there before the end. Now, this seems like the place I'd be a fishing spot, and there is. I bet I could fish here. Progress rod using Aquam. <coughs> I've got myself carp. And I've got a school pen as well. Okay, what was that school pendant I got anyway? Uh, equipment. Uh, Prince Deplo, that's nice. Move to and something. I do need to find out what that cat stuff is all about. Anyway, oh, back into the fog again. The right family houses to the left, so let's go home, shall we? A bright family home. To be fair, I'm happy I bought those two with me because of all the people, those are two which I'd like to in introduce to my house. Ah, doesn't like doesn't look like much fog's got here yet. Wow, is your home, Estelle? It's absolutely lovely. Uh, you think so? Thanks. Anyway, I can fix everyone some tea or something at least. Come inside. Oh, hand to make him a tea. You head up to the rooms upstairs. Um, why? Look up, Estelle. Oh right. House is gonna get pretty damp in this fog. It's always relaxing to get back home. Kind of wonder how much of that is because we're out of a fog, though. Uh, that is part of it, I'm sure. Shara, you know Estelle's house really well, don't you? Of course I do. I've known this house for a long time. A very long time. Yeah, I've been coming over since Mum was alive, so... That's over ten years. It has been a while. About that, give or take a few grey hairs. Shara, were you part of a travelling circus, weren't you? How did you come to make Estelle's acquaintance? Well, you see. Shara, you, you don't need to. It's fine. It's not a story. It would have been about 12 years ago now. Our troop had come to Roland to perform. So at that point, was even more fearless and curious than she is now. To one of our shows, she strode into our tents with purpose. The purpose of playing. Circus troops usually get met with some suspicion by residents of a town outside performances, you see. As a result, 
We weren't really sure what to do at first with this girl who just came to visit us, but you see. Estelle wasn't exactly a timid girl. She kept coming over every day and everyone came to really love her. Myself especially, of course. One day, Estelle didn't want to go home until long after sunset. Since there wasn't any other choice, I ended up being the one who took her home. But that's the day I met Cassius and Lena. I pardon, Lena is Estelle's late mother. Ah, yes. That certainly sounds like Estelle. Estelle, you're incredible. Well, I don't remember that much of it since I was like four back then, but... I do remember Cheryl had come by her house at the time of circles in town after that. That's right. Sounds like you visited a lot of different countries as part of a circus and liked it, right? So why did you come to La Belle to be a bracer? You could say a lot happened. Eight years ago, when I decided I wanted to be a bracer, I came to La Belle to ask Cassius for help. I've been in La Belle ever since. Wow. Oh, that reminds me, uh, was Joshua here in those days? Oh no. Joshua came to live with us three years after that. Actually showed up when you were wearing grace grandson during your Juno Bracer tour, didn't he? That he did. I wandered into La Belle spe spreading good will and flowers, as Bracer does. I turned home to find a boy I'd never seen living with Cassius and Estelle. To say it was a bit of a shock would be an understatement. Still and the others enjoyed a small talk. Finding a little tear in the road, but left Bright House. Not about exploring properly first time. Stella's room and Joshua's room. And um Dad's room. I think anything else in this area. Let's have a quick check. Training area. I thought there might be. I'll use the... Earthworm here. I caught the rock eater. Dropped out a juicy bone. Okay. We got the uh, South Highway complete, West Road, and the North Trail. Ring is in the North, fishing spots I'm doing. <coughs> Millick Main Road has a monster. Let's remind ourselves of the... Where's my mouse? Here's my mouse. So, Mistworld... I'm not going to go there yet because I'm feeling that's one of the places which she could send me. Uh, this one you've got the personal farm but no real diversions. This one you've got the tower, you've got the mine and you've got a quest there. So I've got a quest there, quest there and main quest there, main quest there. That's a location it could send me to later. That's the place it could send me to later. I'm potentially going to go to Vert Bridge first. Vert Bridge is on the main road and um, we know there's a monster on the main road. Hey, that's you, Shara? Bridge! Head of a grandson already? Yeah, the clients are all packed and ready to go. Once you get there, they're going to poke my head in on the Capitol Guildhouse. Keep up the good work. You too, good luck with the fog. Have a road luck. 
Eli's Highway isn't too bad yet. Follow a path down a ways, you should reach the end of the park fairly quickly. Anyway, excuse me. Right, everyone, follow me. Off we go to the capital. Stay close now. Understood, Mr. Brazer. We're counting on you. Okay, off I go. Put that one. Highway monster. Any more quests yet? We're all long term quests, that's fine. Oh, can I upgrade anybody's slot to, um... No, two I can. That one is fine. Show does not have any level 2 slots yet. I can only take green. So I'll replace that one. Chloe has slots upgraded. Tita does not. But it has to be gold. I'll do that one. Coach is heading. I think I've already done that, haven't I? Okay. If I go to the um, ornament thing, go to Estelle, I can now equip HP 4 in that one. I can access the Tiro and the Tira, as well as Diamond Dust. Some good at Ice Tacks there. Anybody else got HP ornament? HP 3 potentially there? Could give you HP 3. If you Tita, you could probably do it, actually. And it gives you 80 more hit points, so... With a Shera... It would give... 200 more. It's actually better on Shera, even though... Tita's got much for your hit points. It makes more sense to put it on Shera... Well, you know, I haven't actually done. I haven't actually checked if I can find it. The sewers here. Fishing spots, eh? Charge. The door is locked. Oh, what a shame. There's monsters in this chest. Oh, that's a lot of monsters. You dirty rat. Smoke cannon. aren't exactly hard. Oh, are we 
run over. Good sorts of stuff I got confused. I think confuse is just a base, isn't it? Yeah. The main thing is I got a fishing spot in there, which is cool. I completely forgot there was a fishing spot in there. Any fishing spots in my mare's area? Uh, nope. any more fishing spots at all in this area so time to head out this way we'll do that in the next episode though so until then thanks for watching have a wonderful day and bye bye